Fisher Technic is a brand of construction toy. It was invented by Artur Fischer and is produced by Fischer Technik GmbH in Waldechtel, Germany. Fans three often refer to Fischer Technik as FT or FEET. It is used in education for teaching about simple machines, as well as motorization and mechanisms. The company also offers computer interface technology, which can be used to teach the theory of automation and robotics. Topic. Origin The company is a German manufacturer of fasteners, and the original Fischer Technik set was intended as a Christmas 1964 novelty gift for engineers and buyers at industrial clients. The gifts proved popular, so for Christmas 1965, the company introduced its first building set for retail sale in Germany. In part, it has been claimed to foster education and interest in technology and science among the young. By about 1970, the construction sets were being sold in the United States at upscale toy retailers such as FAO Schwartz. <laughs> <laughs> Building blocks The basic building blocks were of channel and groove design, manufactured of hard nylon. Basic blocks came in 15 times 15 times 15 and 15 times 15 times 30 mm sizes. A peg on one side of each block could be attached into a channel on any of the other five sides of a similar block, producing a tightly fitting assembly that could assume almost any shape. Red cladding plates could be used to complete the exterior surfaces of the models. Topic: <inaudible> Accessories. The original blocks were characteristically gray with red accessories such as wheels and angled blocks. Electric motors, power sources, and gears were soon added to mobilize models. Additional building pieces such as struts were added in statics sets, allowing the construction of realistic-looking bridges and tower cranes. A few Fischer Technik girders actually are made of aluminum. Other companies make Fischer Technik compatible aluminum bars of any desired length, to teach the physics of such models. Some sets included measuring devices, so that trigonometric vectors could be calculated and tested. Electrical and electronic components The early sets were sophisticated and were often used by engineers to teach and simulate industrial robotics. This use was advanced by the addition of electrical and electronic components such as microswitches, magnetic sensing reed switches, and photocells, which sensed position and provided input to motors. With the basic electronic block which contained an operational amplifier, Schmidt trigger and delay line circuits could be built. In the late 1970s, electronic binary logic modules and NAND, OR, NOR, flip-flops were introduced, so that models could make some branching decisions. Pneumatic devices were made available to provide gripping ability. By the late 1980s, process control CPU modules were added, so that sequences movements could be pre-programmed and executed, first using Lucky Logic LLWIN software. <laughs> <laughs> Kits for younger ages As LEGO became more sophisticated with its Mindstorms line, Fisher Technic attempted to move down into less technical, more fun, building kits for younger ages. The parts were molded from more colorful plastics, and small building sets were developed for simple models such as vehicles. However, the Fisher products were more expensive and had far fewer parts that replicated everyday objects than LEGO. Especially in the United States, Fisher Technic never achieved parity with Lego in the general construction toy market, and FT is still more positioned as a product for schools, engineers, and hobbyists. The sets are not as available at retail as Lego products in the United States, or even in Europe. Topic. 
Robotic process control By 2006, Fisher Technic sets were available for robotic process control using RoboPro software, the successor to Lucky Logic. Onboard process controllers with flash memory, infrared and radio frequency remote control, and pneumatic activation. Robotic models could follow pre-programmed routes or lines on the floor, sense obstructions and change course, detect and move objects, and simulate everyday devices such as vending machines, passenger elevator systems, and traffic control lights. In early 2010, Fisher Technic introduced the Robo TX Explorer kit, which includes a color sensor. Topic: Sets. Fisher Technic has produced myriad different sets over the years, and the company has several times renamed existing sets. Moreover, there have been as many as five different lines of these sets often referred to as A, B, C, D, and E in fan circles with similar but differing components all compatible, of course. Roughly these fit into the production years 1967 to 1971, 1972 to 1975, 1976 to 1981, 1981 to 1984 and 1984 to 1991. The A line featured predominantly black and white images whereas the B line features the Oscar Dujoy 1970 award on the box design. C saw the introduction of black plastic cogs earlier they were all red, and D saw the introduction of yellow plastic statics, whereas before they were gray. The following equivalencies can help make sense of some of the core sets Start 300 <laughs> Start 200 plus 50 thirds Start 100 plus 50 halves plus 50 thirds equals start 50 plus 50 over 1 plus 50 halves plus 50 thirds Hobby 1 Topic UT1 Selected parts from start 300 but significantly abbreviated Hobby 2 Topic UT two Mo one plus Mo two plus Mo three. The Hobby two UT two lacks the battery box that comes with Mo one. Hobby three. Topic UT three. EM one plus EM two plus EM three. The M stands for electromechanical. Hobby four. Topic UT four. EC one plus EC two plus EC three. The EC stands for electronic. Hobby S. Topic Start fifty S plus fifty S one plus fifty S two plus fifty S three. Note that those are S structural, not a five. Note that prior to the Fisher Technic C line nineteen seventy six, the starter sets didn't have as many parts, and neither did their add-on kits fifty over one, fifty halves, fifty thirds. Because the older manuals lack copyright dates or official line designations, it is difficult to distinguish sets without in-depth knowledge of what was actually in the box for each line and set. More recently, Fisher Technic has started producing a whole line of kits specialized for the construction of particular models, like boats, airplanes, bridges, cranes, etc. This is something of a departure from their traditional niche producing generic sets from which literally hundreds of different models can be built. 
Fisher Technic has also started producing advanced robotic sets, including battery packs, remote controls, and programmable control boards. See also Lego Technic <laughs>